In this video, I'm going to show you how to apply a credit note to a bill on Xero. So the first step is to log in to your Xero account and then head to the dashboard. Now from here, we're just going to look for the business tab over in this section, give it a click, and then select bills to pay. Now under bills to pay, we'll be able to see a list of all the bills we have on our Xero account. They're also categorized under draft, awaiting approval, awaiting payment, paid, and repeating. Now from here, we can just go ahead and look for the bill that we wish to apply a credit note to. Now just uh, as a brief description to what a credit note is or what its purpose credit notes are basically like legal documents that allow us to cancel out an already issued invoice either in full or part payment it also indicates a uh, return of funds to the bearer and credit notes are usually used after let's say a cancellation of an order if there are any lost or damaged goods or if there's an invoice error so now let's proceed on applying a credit note to a bill let's say we have here the bayside wholesale there's a bill that's awaiting payment for 840 usd we're gonna go ahead and open this bill and we'll be able to see the details of this bill. Now, let's say there was an invoice error in uh, this bill, or maybe some of the goods were lost. Now we're gonna try to apply a credit note just to give us a safety net for uh, the transaction. So here in the bill options drop down, we're just going to give this a click and then all the way down, we're going to select add credit note. Now here we'll be able to edit the details of the credit note. And basically what we're going to do here is just, we're just going to ensure that the details are as accurate as the one in the original bill so we're going to open the old bill on a new window should be under awaiting approval or rather awaiting payment and bayside wholesale for 840 usd so item code gb1 white golf balls white single all right those are good Quantity 200, unit price of 4.20. Now we see here the unit price is different in this bill. The accounts under purchases. The tax on purchases. So the tax has been applied on this breakdown. The total is 840. The totals match. So we're pretty much good to go with this so from here we're just going to go ahead and click on approve or we can also click save in case for example we need it as a draft for now and um or we need to edit it in the future or uh wait for someone to approve it so we're just going to save it and then submit it for approval now if you have administrative powers in the account in your zero account then of course you can go ahead and approve this credit note right here so we're going to go ahead and do that and once that's done the credit note will be approved and we'll have that credit note applied to the bayside wholesale bill so we're going to go ahead and check on bills to pay and as we can see here we have the bayside wholesale bill as well as the credit note for Bayside Wholesale. And that's about it. 
That's how you apply a credit note to a bill on Xero. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to help you out.